And we don't want no problems Okay, here I go What's it going to a problem? Yeah, the game on the beat I fuck around and leave a <laughs> Hey everyone, what's up? It's Scoped and Shot here with a uh, Call of Duty World of War gameplay. Um, it's gonna be some uh, war on uh, knee deep. Uh, I'm gonna be using the Thompson submachine gun with a round drum and uh, bomb squad stopping power uh, steady aim. Good stuff. Uh, so, I think this might be ground war, uh, like, ground war, war, whatever. Sound really weird, but, yeah, this is taken about two weeks ago, and, yeah, and I need to get the final games off of my hard, hard drive from, uh, uh, World at War. I think I have one more game left. Um, so, yeah, in this video, uh, it's a pretty decent KD ratio, uh, it's 3.4 KD. Cause I go 34 and 10, and that guy a juggernaut. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, yeah, what I was kind of thinking, cause uh, my PS3 is it's gonna be back tomorrow on Monday, uh, the 26th of April. And so what I was thinking is that for Modern Warfare 2, the rest of my gameplay videos they should all, you know, have a 4.0 KD ratio or more. Whether or not I'll, I'll follow through on this, uh, I don't know, but. Yeah, I think that would probably be a good idea, because it'll make the videos, you know, it'll make them look better, you know, like the score-wise. Then also, I probably shouldn't post anything that has over, you know, 10 or 12 deaths. Because no one likes to see me dying. That's not fun. But, yeah. So, uh, yeah, uh, I guess I'll talk about the gameplay. Uh, right now, um, basically my whole strategy for the game was to, uh, um, stay around like this big house most of the time, and uh, yeah, basically just like patrol this whole area and get behind the, get behind the enemies. And it's actually gonna turn out pretty good for me. I think I get like a 15 kill streak. Uh, yeah, here's my 10 kill streak. Yeah, right here. Um, I was planning to uh stay right by the riverbed because that's where they're all spawning. Uh, yeah, there, there's a lot of guys down there. Uh, but yeah, there, I switched, I pick up an MP40, because that's a really good gun, obviously, and, and yeah, since we, uh, captured the, uh, first main flag, uh, you know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna sit right next to the, uh, that flag right there, and I, I'm actually gonna go up in the house now, and, See if I can rain down terror to them. Like right there, 15 kill streak. I try to get that guy a juggernaut. Said so I get that guy for the 16 kill streak. Um, uh, there's an artillery, and there should be a guy coming up this ladder. I look down, but he's not. And he, I think they, someone killed him. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go back to this the uh, to the little window. Make sure that no one's coming up the stairs, though, because I f kind of feel that uh, someone's going to do it. There's a stupid guy with Juggernaut. <laughs> that took forever. And yeah, there's another guy for the uh, 18 kill streak. And I'm kind of feeling the pressure of them uh, coming up these stairs, so, uh... Yeah, there's one. And, and then I get, you know, I get rushed, and... Overall, that was a good run right there. Now, one thing that I hate about World of War is it seems like no one ever aims their gun in the game. It's kind of pathetic. I don't know. It's just annoying. Like, you know, half the time I get killed, you know, a guy's like trying to not aim his gun for like 50 feet. And it's kind of pathetic. But, whatever. That's always been one of World of War's problems, even though it's not like a fixable problem. It's just people's decision making in this game. But it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I mean, all my World of War videos that I posted lately have all been Thompson. And, yeah, I mean, I don't want to be... 
I don't know what the word would be, maybe like a scrub or something, but I don't want to be using the easy to use MP40. There, I just get taken out by the uh, MP40. Uh, yeah, I just I just want to be don't want to be stupid and use the uh, MP40, but it doesn't really matter because my PS2 will be back on will be back on Monday and I'll be back on MW2 rage quitting all the time. Uh, but that's kind of normal. Uh, but yeah, right here, uh, well, a couple seconds ago, the, uh, enemy took the, uh, last objective, so we have to fall back. I, I, I like war because of the, uh, momentum thing, you know, you get to get Blitzkrieg and all that stuff. It's pretty fun. Uh, and yeah, it's kind of like, uh, MW2's demolition, I guess, because, you know, there's always going to be a fixed spawn, f spawn point for, uh, so for both teams. And yeah, just sometimes if you do push back, they will end up spawning behind you, but as soon as you either get taken out or you take them out, the spawn will be back to normal. And there that guy gets artillery and kills two people and himself. <laughs> and uh, yeah, for some reason in Vegas, uh, the video FX uh, tab thingy, which is where I add my uh, color correction and uh, sharpen to my videos, and uh, it's not there. I don't know where it went. I can't figure out where it went. So yeah, <laughs> kind of weird. Whatever. I'll figure it out, or I'll just re-download it. Yeah, this is this is where I did most of my damage was in this house, and there's a guy running right on that roof, and I try to kill him, but it doesn't work. I, I'm just gonna ignore him, I think. That's where having a uh, MP40 comes in handy. Especially that this thing with stopping power is beastly. Even though it's just like the uh, um 45 from uh, uh, Modern Warfare 2, it does not need stopping power. But I on my on PS3, I always use this thing with stopping power. I don't know why. Like you know, first I started out with using it with a uh, Juggernaut, and then I went to uh, Double Tap, and then I went to uh, stopping power. Cause I kind of felt bad using this thing with Juggernaut. Cause you know I was Temper Siege, and like every time you saw a Temper Siege, he was always using MP40 with Juggernaut, and that was just pathetic. But yeah, now in Modern Warfare 2, there's no Juggernaut, there's Painkiller, and uh, Painkiller. No one likes that. So yeah, we got about uh, two minutes left, and. Uh, yeah, I'm still gonna be camping in this house for a lot. Um, I'm kind of waiting for someone to come up the stairs, but it looks like our team's holding him back pretty good too over there. But there's a guy sitting right on right there, and I did not see him. That's what happens when you're on a little standard definition TV. But uh, yeah. And I thought that was a bad guy. <laughs> um, and yeah, if you guys haven't seen it already, um, there is, it's not an, it's not official, but there is this, uh, it, it's supposed to be a, uh, website for COD 7, or COD Black Ops, Call of Duty Black Ops. Um, it's called GK Nova dot, or no, GK Nova 6, like G-K-N-O-V-A 6 dot com, and, uh, yeah, you go to it. It takes like it takes like a minute to load, and then there's like a TV, and there's like e there's like three buttons that actually work, and there's two buttons that don't work, and you press um some of the buttons, and like different things will happen. Like uh, there's I think it's Morse code that's on there. Um, yeah, there's some uh, Morse code and stuff, and I don't know. It's just kind of you know, it's just kind of telling you that it's uh gonna be in the Vietnam War. Cause there's a uh, like video of JFK. Um, yeah, video of JFK and, and then some like random Morse code and something about like atomic like atoms and stuff. Um, yeah. There, I'm pretty much doing pretty good. Getting artillery and just hurried and called in for my points. But there, he, there he goes. The uh, game, 35 and 10. 34 and 10, I mean. 
um, we're using the Thompson round drum, not an MP40. Uh, thanks for watching. Like it, like the video, comment, rate, subscribe, comment, like, subscribe. Uh, thanks and peace.